<laughs> Alright guys, Danny from Life.ATV here. Today I got kind of a different video for you. Today I'm going to be showing you my new truck. It's a 2005 Chevy 2500. And it's, uh, it's got the 6 on it, so it's gas. And pretty happy with it. As you can see, it's got really nice tires, bead locks, 18 inches. And it's got this nice green, almost zero rust on it. Big tires. It's all undercoated underneath too. You can see some rust, so on all, I'm pretty happy with it. Shot from the front. I'm not for sure the size of the lift on it, but it's pretty nice. It's a little dirty right now, but I'll give you a shot of the interior. I wanted this year purely because of the inside too. It's got the nice leather seats. Give you a look. Oh, it's kind of high up there. So, it's got nice exhaust on it, too. So that's nice, nice tunnel cover. 166,000 miles on it, so it's not bad. Chevy will last forever, ain't that right? You bet your ass. <laughs> Die hard Ford guys will like that car, man. <laughs> so what's your guys' thoughts on it, the rest of the crew? She's nice. Is very nice, Danny. Got a nice, got a nice stance to her. Yeah. What's the, you guys don't miss the old Ford? She wasn't oh, bad, was no. she? Cole's not a Ford fan, though. No. I'm not. I'm a Chevy guy. Chevy guy. <laughs> I don't know. I always figure teach is on. Yeah. If we all like the same thing, it'd be a pretty boring close. Well, the goal is with a 2500 that we eventually want to get like a 20 foot enclosed trailer. That way we can haul all the machines in and this can kind of haul it. That's the goal, at least. That'd be pretty cool. Find a, find a nice used one, get a nice wrap on it. Like it, Brookies? Yeah. <laughs> Never thought I'd be a fan of green, huh? Yeah, but I like I it with this. Green. I wasn't expecting it to be green when we pulled up to the freaking lot. Yeah, no kidding. Code came with me to come get it, and we couldn't believe how big it was. How tall it was. They're like the wheels the best. Yeah, the wheels are the best. And you know what? She actually drives pretty nice with them on. You hear a little chatter from stuff hidden underneath, but I don't know. I like it. Look, look badass driving it, so. The coat looks pretty freaking nice in her. Pretty high up though, aren't I you? I one of my own, buddy. <laughs> He's more of a Dodge fan, but that, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Dodge diesel. There we go. You know, I was thinking about a diesel, but I don't think I was really ready for the work that goes into maintaining them. But you can definitely see if you were reeling in the dough, how a diesel would be. Yeah. And I paid, I think, 11000 for this, guys, which I don't think is bad. I mean, for, the, for all the mods and everything that's already on it, for all the aftermarket stuff, that's not a bad deal, I don't think. 160,000 miles, which is a little high, but, you know, like I said. Yeah, these six these six O's I've heard. If you take care of them and do regular maintenance, then take care of it, Danny. She lasts a long time. Yeah. Now look, guys, envision 20 foot enclosed trailer, Life.ATV wrap on it. Jesus. Renegade in the back, brand new Renegade. YFZ. There we brand go. <laughs> and we still got the old reliable Raptor. So first time off road. She's off roading. <laughs> 